Did I miss it? <gasps> oh, I didn't miss it. Oh no. No, what are you doing? We are back and welcome back to the channel, everybody. It is that time of the week again. Yes, you know it. There's only one thing that you could possibly be here for, and it's me shitting myself for 20 minutes for your guys' entertainment. And today, we've got a pretty big one. Today, we are going to be reacting to a channel called Goose Pimples. Now, Goose Pimples is a fairly new channel, kind of centered around a Nukes Top 5s kind of theme channel, but their videos are outstanding nonetheless. They may be a small channel, but trust me, their videos are incredible. And today's video is called Five Scary Ghost Videos That Will Mess You Up. If you know me on a Tuesday, you know I'm down to be messed up. So, before we get into it, be sure to get yourself a brew, turn off the lights, and let's get into some scary stuff. Right, Goose Pimples, let's see what you got for me, baby. Away we go. Oh, it's a rough start. Okay. Okay. I am so excited for this. I haven't got any backup with me today, as you can probably tell. So, it's going to be raw. Very raw. Very uncomfortably raw. Five scary ghost videos time. so scary you'll quit YouTube. Oh, what? I need to sign up for this. Dave's story must be told. So, we move. Continuing our quest to find out whether ghosts exist or not. We bring you some of the terrifying new videos that will certainly give you goose pimples. Oh, I'm so excited! We know when it comes to ghosts, people are either skeptics or believers. That's why we try our very best to find authentic and unedited footage. Fair play. If you are ready to get a paranormal punch in the face, hit the subscribe button. Sit back and relax knowing you'll never miss another one. I'm so excited. Number five. Ghost Number sighting five. at the Kadena Air Base in Japan. Ooh. Kadena Air Base is arguably one of the most scariest places in Japan. Gate 3 in particular. Proves to be a paranormal hotspot and the creepiest place as an air base. Legend has it that the ghost of a bloody World War II soldier approaches people and asks for a light for his cigarette. Interesting. People claim that such sightings occur almost weekly. Marines refuse to stand guard at this gate because of their first-hand brushes with the dead soldier. Okay. Even security cameras installed at the gates frequently capture unexplainable activities. One such activity you will watch now. Oh, I'm so excited. Here we go. Did I miss it? <gasps> oh, I didn't miss it. Oh. This CCTV oh. footage from 2008 shows a black human-like figure appearing out of nowhere. The oh. shadowy figure moves from behind a sign and across the road. This is just like this video supports it. the stories that have been told about the base. Yeah, I'd what say. What do you think? I'd is this say, video real, yeah. or is it just a clever camera trickery? It could be, Let us but know in the comments section. I don't know. Number I like that. Four. We're off to a good start, here, guys. Hallway. The Haunted Hallway. Deer Park CBS School in Cork was founded in 1828 and it is one of Ireland's oldest buildings. Nice. Faculty members often complain about strange noises coming from the hallway and things moving on their own. Okay, that's This not nice. footage was captured around 3am when no one was present in the building. Whatever occupies the hallway decided to play around, giving us major goose pimples. Oh, that's not okay. According to school authorities, there is a motion-activated camera installed on the site. As soon as the camera sensed its activity, it started recording and gave us all this terrifying ghost footage. The hallway doors open unannounced, oh. and things start tumbling along. Oh, that's not alright. With weird noises in the background, the furniture rocks back and forth unaided. And suddenly, a locker flies open, spilling paper. Oh. 
Do you see how such heavy closets swing and smack against the school wall? There's a strange flashlight seen from behind a locked door while closets wave and rattle. Suddenly, the locker's doors break open. That's mental. Books and papers fly to the floor. Isn't it spooky? Oh, Are you gosh. glad the footage has ended? Sorry, bad news. There's more. Oh god, there's always more, isn't there? There's always more! Oh, what are we looking at here? Come on, tell me. Oh, I've got chills, man. It's not okay. Right. That chair's levitating. Oh, no, man! Do you think it's possible to fake this footage? Or do you believe there's something paranormal going on? Let us know in the comments below. Number. Right. Just, just on that, right? That locker one got me the most. Like, the weight of a locker itself is mental. You couldn't have fit someone behind it. Like, you could see the gap was too small. And string, surely string would not be to fully tip a locker. I'm like, damn, I would never go back to school ever again. For a free haunted house. How are you then? Let's see what you got. Nothing can be more sinister than living in a home haunted by the dead. Imagine the feeling you would have after witnessing a series of strange events night after night. That is what happened with Sibia L from the Netherlands. She claims that her apartment is haunted, and she's captured countless unexplainable events on camera. From those gliding in and out of rooms to strange noises late at night. What you will watch now is raw, unfiltered, uncut poltergeist activity captured on camera by Sibia. I've seen this one from and it's not outlook, okay. It seems like a normal home. But within mere seconds, things start to take a scary turn. Mm -hmm. What happens next will make you want to sleep with your lights on tonight. First, the light shade on the ceiling starts swinging. Then the kitchen's light switches on itself. That's just the beginning. Sabir is scared but decides to check on who's in the kitchen. She slowly moves forward. We can tell she's freaking out already by her breathing. What she sees in the kitchen will make you jump out your seat. Uh, Take a look. I don't like it. Oh, always hated this video, man. Just scares the sh his name out of me. Think that time. is enough for goose pimples for now. Wait until you watch our latest video. Two weeks ago, Sabi uploaded another terrifying video. Oh, I haven't seen this one. The activity starts with the light shade moving abruptly. No. Where's the lamp shade, man? Where's the lamp shade? Then a few seconds after, she noticed some movement on the curtains. That's when things go bump in the night. No, it's not okay. <sighs> the curtains move alone, and suddenly one side is pulled wide open. However, it doesn't stop there. As she quickly checks if someone or something is behind it, she finds nothing. Oh, 
Oh, and the door's locked and everything. Door's shut. No. Uh, that is not okay. Oh, it spooks me, man. No. She then hears a voice in the kitchen and turns just in time to catch something being thrown towards her. Oh, hell to prove that no! One is no. There, she goes straight to the kitchen, turns the lights on, and shows an empty room. That she is even shows us up. that the back door is locked. Oh, it is locked. Unfortunately, we can understand what she said just before the video ended. But if you happen to speak her language, please let us know in the comments. We would love to know. Oh, let me hear. Right, got it. She said, fuck this shit, I'm out of here. How dare it throw my smoothie? That's what she said. Like, I'd be pretty pissed off too. Fuck this shit. Just to clarify, I don't actually know what she said. Like, I'm just making this up. It's been over what I was saying. Number two. Number two. It seems like the dead enjoy spending their nights in the kitchen because in this video, a YouTuber <laughs> Sylvia <laughs> C also captured unusual activity inside her apartment kitchen. Come on, Sylvia. This video is definitely not for the weak hearted because living in a home where you have this kind of stuff occurring can't be easy. Check Here out Sylvia's brush with the supernatural in the middle of the night. It all starts with the washer door opening and closing on its own repeatedly. Okay. Then the cabinet door to the center open and shut slowly, as if something was trying to get out, but couldn't. Oh, that's... It's the bangs? It's the banging? It's the banging that gets me. That's not alright. Hypothesis. Big. Big. Hypothesis. We have got the matching kettle, right? I know you know where I'm going with this. It's the kettle that's haunted. Britta. Britta are haunting people. Buy yourself one of these kettles, you're getting a ghost with it. That's my hypothesis. Can't be a coincidence that two people with the same kettle have scary activity. We move. It's just not alright, is it? And it's a camera right. the far right opens for a while, and then it closes. We believe that whatever was trying to come out finally did, and we don't know what happens next because the screen goes black. Oh, it's just there to wreak havoc! Before we show you number one, you might want to switch the light on, because it is truly terrifying. It's alright, we're in broad daylight. You hit the like and subscribe buttons to scare the ghosts away. Oh! Okay! Oh, I already have, and I've subbed, and I've tickled the bell. Make sure to tickle that bell, guys. Right, now I've done that, we move. Let's be having you. Number one, spooky one. Santa Muerte statue. Wow. Santa Muerte, which means Our Lady of the Holy Death, is a female deity. A cult okay. image and folk saint in Mexican neo paganism and Catholicism. Oh, wow. wow. The statue is regarded as the personification of death and safe delivery for, to the afterlife. Oh, wow. There's such a vast number of myths and mystic stories associated with the Santa Muerte that it has attracted paranormal researchers' attention for centuries. Oh, that's so cool! The statue itself will give you the creeps. 
starting with its scary skull face. The deity is also cloaked in black wielding a scythe in its right hand with the left held out in front as if it's waiting to take your hand. Legend has it that the Santa Muerte is your gateway to hell. Staying too close to it is not advised. Otherwise, bad things may happen to you. That's mental. What's that one in the house? As you will see in this video, decided to give it a try. It did not go well. Watch what happens when they walk into a cemetery in the middle of the night looking for Santa Muerte statue. Goose pimples, you have succeeded. I have got goose pimples. Consider that a success. Spooky. The pair found the deity and decided to play around a bit. They shouldn't have done so because it has angered Santa Muerte. Here's oh. what happened. It's como si se parara de este lugar y deambulara por las noches por los pasillos porque sabemos que su energía es muy fuerte y es lo que se cuenta. Y me dice Rogelio que va a ser el juego del cigarro. ¿En qué se basa este juego, Rogelio? Pues nos va a perseguir a los, a los más puntitos. A base de información que nos está haciendo. What's he doing? What are you doing, man? 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 Oh, no, I'm gonna go to the house. Oh, no, what are you doing? They ran to save their lives, but we couldn't understand what they were saying. My lord! So, if you know some Spanish, we would love it if you could explain in the comments below. Oh my lord, man! Oh! Oh no, man! No te dejaron realizar no. este juego que querías hacer. Because you're messing with no, things no, you don't no, understand. No. Porque en ese punto. Que you do understand. That's very judgmental of me. Yo no las quiero arriesgar a ustedes. Está enojado alguien porque sí. estamos aquí. Esta parte está muy fuerte. Well, Goose Pimples, you successfully shitted me up for another week running, and I, um, I loved that. That was actually very, very, very good. Um. If you guys would like to check out Goose Pimples channel for yourselves, we highly, highly recommend it. We will leave a link down in the description and you guys could be some of the OG subs over there. Let's see if we can get Goose Pimples to over a thousand subscribers. How mad would that be? Be sure, if you go over there, leave a comment, let them know that we sent you and um, let them know what you think of the video. Um, but... What do you guys think of those clips that Goose Pimples shared with us today? Do you think they're legit? Do you think they're fake? If so, leave it down in the comments below. Let us know what you think, because honestly, the highlight of my Tuesday is reading your suggestions and theories. I absolutely love it. But with all that said, thank you guys so much for joining me on another Tuesday reaction terrifying time. Um, all that's left to say, guys, is thank you so much for joining me. I can't wait to see you in the next video. And 